I get those goosebumps every time I need the high to throw that to the side yo. I get those goosebumps every time Hello everybody, it's Cobes here and today I am back with a Pocket Morty's video In today's video, we will be playing another Morty's game Go to the Rick or Treat store like always and buy yourself a loot box I am sorry if I fuck up during this commentary It's because I haven't slept well, a couple hours actually. I slept a couple hours, got up, decided, you know what, why not record a video? Because that makes sense. I'll be doing a walkthrough of Morty and Need, because why not? If you guys need help with any of this, any of these Morty's games, I hope I can help you. So let's go with Big Tongue Morty, Cyclops Morty. Should we pick any lower level Morty's? I think if we have a paper and scissors type, that should be good enough. We are wasting some elixir, but I'm gonna continue anyways. I'm really trying not to have too many cuts in these videos. It's gonna be more of a walkthrough, like I said earlier. But again, I mess up quite often, so I have to make these cuts. The first thing you want to do, so we have a paper and scissors type. That means if you face a paper type, you automatically wanna switch out to your scissors type. You can figure out what type you're facing first if you really want to investigate i will show you how to do that next this guy doesn't have any scissors type attacks which kind of sucks but we're only facing two mortys i believe for this first trainer i don't know exactly how this works i don't know how many trainers we are going up against this is kind of a trial run and if it works out then i'll end up uploading it if it didn't work out i'll just redo it but right now cyclops morty he is pretty low on health Let's see, this guy is a paper type, I'm almost positive. He is. If we have to use a great serum, we might end up using it just to keep our Cyclops Morty alive. That is my tip. Keep all your Mortys alive no matter what the cost is. Because if you lose a Morty and you were down to one Morty, it's going to be very difficult to survive the game with only one Morty with one type against multiple different types you'll be going against whether it be scissors paper or rock type because with two different types you will be able to face every opponent no matter what because if worse comes to worst you'll either have the advantage or you'll have the same type as the enemy the same whether it be paper or scissor type you or or rock if you have a rock type but for this video it'd be paper or scissors if you have a paper or scissors or a paper and rock or a scissors and rock that means you can go up against anyone and you will either be on an equal playing field or you will have the advantage. So I hope that does help help you out. I just used that great serum on Cyclops Morty. I don't want to waste my other serums yet because he would only gain 8 HP of health when that serum, those serums give him 20 HP. So I really don't want to waste that. So here we go. We're facing a rock type. Paper types are definitely more powerful. Use the attack move called Soggy Kiss, and Flu Morty should go down with two hits. This is fairly easy, guys. I think we're gonna face one more trainer after this. We really have no problems, but after we're done beating these guys, we will use the rest of our items. That's my tip. This guy is a rock type. I'm almost positive, and yes, he is. So two more times, we'll use Soggy Kiss. No, three more times, actually. But after this, we'll have to use that Platonic Rock on Big Tongue Morty. I would just say use the Platonic Rock on whoever has fewer attacks or whoever is more powerful. Wow, he killed him. Alright, that actually works out perfectly for me. So this guy has four more Soggy Kisses attacks, or four more Soggy Kiss attacks, which is definitely enough to defeat this next trainer. I hope so at least. So, Strawberry Morty, he is a scissors type. I Or no, he is a paper type. Strawberry Morty is a paper type. I know that for sure. So, let's use a Platonic Rock. Let's use a Serum. And I'm going to show you how you know what Morty you're going to go against first. Alright. Now, switch Cyclops Morty to the top. Just trust me, do it. If you go up to this guy... The guy behind the trainer is the first Morty you will face. So Strawberry Morty is a paper type. We know that. You can look that up. If you know the Morty's name, you can look it up. Figure out what type he is. And then go along accordingly. Or you can just follow me. But 
for this case we knew strawberry morty was a paper type so before we even got into the battle we got prepared because we took out our scissors type right away we switched them to our top spot and that's gonna help us take less hits and do more damage so definitely make sure if you're having trouble winning make sure to look up the mortys whether they be paper rock or scissors type and then change your mortys around accordingly but we should be able to win this pretty easily we don't have any more items this guy is doing so much shit to me he's raising my accuracy he's taking down my defense i don't even know what he's doing anymore but he's really not doing any damage hopefully with one more swing we can take him out there we go so it's a 2v2 situation right now and we have very powerful mortys i think mini morty if i'm not mistaken is a rock type so that means we're going to switch out to Big Tongue Morty because paper beats rock somehow. It does. It, it, crumples, it crumples it up into a ball and then you can throw the rock even further due to the weight increase. Fuck it. I don't know what I'm saying, guys. But I do really enjoy recording these videos. I love giving you guys tips. And so many people come to me and say, wow, you got me into this game and you teach me so much about this game that's really what i love to do i love teaching you guys something new even if it's just a little game that's not even fun no i'm joking this game's awesome i love this game people are gonna get salty and hate me in the comment section before you know in a stream i talked about how i didn't like rick rick and morty or pocket mortys even though it was a joke but people got so pissed at me I was losing subscribers, but come on guys, keep watching my videos, they're helpful, they might be helpful if you're beginning a beginning player, or maybe even if you're a more advanced player. I am trying to be the best player in the world, I think that can happen, once I get every Morty to level 100, I think officially I'll be the best player in the world. But there we go, we defeated them. We defeated everyone. We get 200 Schmeckles, a Morty Manipulator Chip. Now we have two more Morty's games to go until we get the next Morty. Thank you guys so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please smack the like button. Slap it. Kick it. Touch it with your nose. Do whatever the hell you want. I really do appreciate you guys watching these videos. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.